take a look the topic is introduction to language i will tell you about language when a person communicates with another person he or she may understand the message clearly this is done by the use of language language is a communication tool used by everyone in their daily life as a means to convey information if we do not acquire language will we be able to communicate no it's impossible language helps us to think and express our ideas and feelings that is why language is essential let me give you an example when children or adults use sign language or spoken language language fills every part of their lives like it gives words to our thoughts voice to our ideas and expression to our feelings for when a child observes the moon a thought pattern generates they look at its color that is white and shape and the word manifest in the mind that it is the moon another example by looking at a tree the word mapping our mind manifest tree if we see mobile phone then the particular systematized word automatically start mapping in our mind likewise we map words for different objects and feelings using language we use language automatically without practically thinking about it through language we can express ideas and expressions in sign and spoken languages you might think that language has limited scope but that is not true languages are alive and growing there can be unlimited words and sentences in a language and there are millions of usage of language in different context making them vastly rich does a person need to ponder a lot to speak one word like bird or give too much thought to say motorcycle not at all the point is that we use language automatically without practically thinking about it we acquire it naturally from our environment and our mind associates the words accordingly so when we see a bird automatically the word bird comes into our mind or when we see a cycle or bike we immediately express the words within split seconds also children acquire sign or spoken language from their environment effortlessly and getting exposure to language they naturally start expressing in it easily languages are not generally simple they are quite complex let me explain that to you to infants start babbling at first then later speak a word or two word clearly that is easy or simple then they combine words to make simple sentences the child keeps perceiving the meaning of the different words in a sentence and acquire that as well language is highly complex in that it is based on a set of rules relating symbols to their meanings thereby forming an infinite number of possible innovative utterances from a finite number of elements a skilled adult speaker tend to complicate languages by looking for ways to be more expressive children may be able to learn their language relatively quickly but it becomes more difficult when lot of new concepts and complex sentences are learned another example we have different deaf signers with varying intellect a deaf person who acquired sign language at early age and have language foundation we may say that person has higher intellect by observing their language skills that is how fluent they sign our vast intelligence also allow us to have language language give us the ability to communicate our intelligence to others by talking reading and writing hence languages are rich and complex